Hello world, I'm Rich, and this is Rich's World Beer Tour. Minnesota Monday, and you notice we're inside. It's still cold out. It's nuts, it's March. Um, we should be a lot warmer than this. Hey, I got a surprise here for Minnesota Monday. I was hoping to be the first person to review this, but I missed out. Uh, Eric Wood, who's also local here in the Twin Cities. Uh, check him out, Eric with a K. Eric Wood does some great beer reviews, uh, but he beat me to it. Uh, Blacker Imperial Black Ale. Check that out. The three headed monster there. That's what you're looking for. It says this double, double black as night IPA is too massive for just one brewery's efforts. Blacker took the Trinity of Real Ale Brewing uh, out of Texas, Surly here in Brooklyn Park, Minnesota, and Three Floyds uh, out of. Uh, Indiana. So uh, they put it together. A double uh, Imperial Black Ale. Um, they got some fun stuff. I don't know if you're into this. Looks like, uh, I don't know if we can get that on there, but it looks like a Led Zeppelin cover. Uh, all these symbols water, alcohol, eternal darkness, fermentation, fire, flavor, pint, grain, trinity, boil. Union, oh, there's the Trinity, uh, Trinity Boil, Union, Carbon Dioxide, Metal, and Wizard. I think I got them in the right order. I don't know. Got that off the website. So, this stuff, a four pack, uh, 19 bucks. So, this better be darn good. Um, thought we'd uh, give her a try. I have yet to have a bad beer from Surly. And I was dying. I heard, I heard this was in the works, but didn't get a date, and boom, there it was. And I poured it pretty aggressive. That's a pretty, like they said, dark as night, and oh yeah, falling over the edge. Beautiful, uh, I don't know, 18 fingers worth of head. I poured that pretty good. This is going to be uh, tough since I poured it like that. Oh well. Yeah, there's just no seeing through. Oh wow, pine. Just resiny pine right away hits you. There's, I mean, that is the overall. And this citrus, you know, everything you'd think of in a uh, an IPA, what's this? It's a black ale. It smells like a good surly IPA. Pine and citrus, just that citrus rind. I'm not getting anything else. That's just. I don't know, and that's fine with me. Anyways, let's give it a try. Cheers. Got a little mustache off of that. Oh, wow. Oh, all that citrus rind and that I was talking about and pine those uh, citrusy hops all over it wow but there's all this other stuff going on kind of a roasted barley or roasted malt chocolates in there um, oh wow yeah malt some sweet malt Baker's chocolate, licorice. Oh man, this is as if you took um, surly uh, furious or um, abrasive and mixed it with darkness. There's this chocolatey, malty, uh, bitter chocolate flavors from darkness, and there is all this resiny pine citrusy thickness to it. I'm not seeing a lot of bubbles coming up but I poured it pretty aggressive. The head's going down. Oh this is this is nice. I'm, I'm, it's not carbonated. Um, I'm feeling a little little bit of a burn. This is they have the alcohol on here. I don't know what the ABV is. I apologize for not checking. 
and this was Surly's really good about putting this on the bottom canned on February 17th so we're about uh, two weeks two weeks fresh here and I've had it for a few days this is this is really good All those things. The, the licorice is actually standing out now that it, it's warming up, and I, I didn't have it too cool. But all that pine and citrus, caramel, chocolate, um, wow. Um, locally here, I don't know what the distribution is. If uh, someone's watching this from Surly or or uh, Real Ale or Three Floyds, can you let us know what the distribution is? I mean, we're pretty spread out between the three breweries. Love to know what the distribution is. Locally here in the Twin Cities. This is uh, 19 bucks for a four pack, four of these uh, cans. Would I go out and buy a whole bunch of those? On my budget, no. Uh, is it fun to grab a four pack? Absolutely, this is a knockout. Um, great beer, and what an interesting combination. You know, full mouth feel, um, coats, my, coats my mouth, coats my tongue, leaves a little stickiness on your lips. Um, that pine, that resinous pine and citrus, uh, uh, kind of a grapefruit and orange peel sitting on the back of my palate. Um, wow, this is a 9.5. Um, if you can get it, grab a four pack, grab it fresh, try it, and put some notes down below. Let me know what you're uh, tasting. If you're getting all that uh, kind of a combination of abrasive and darkness, this is awesome. Um, anyways, uh, check it out. It's uh, blacker which is uh, means black in one of the Nordic languages. Imperial Black Ale, Three Floyds, Surly, and Real Ale. Put her together. There's the three-headed monster. That's what you're looking for. Grab a four-pack, grab one, see if you can get on tap, and let me know what you're tasting. Uh, another Minnesota Monday. Thanks for sharing a beer with me, world. Cheers.